Well, hello, everybody, and welcome back to another episode here from my Minecraft Survival Let's Play. How is everybody doing? Oh, man, me and Paul was hanging out right here in front of the house. We have an uninvited guest in there. That's right, let me show you. If you saw in the intro video, this guy has been living in my house. Where'd he go? Oh, I hear you. Where are you at? Are you upstairs? Where is he? I know he's here somewhere. I hear you. Don't you dare start hiding from me. I'm going to show people where you at. He's upstairs. Oh, trapped, I see. Thank you for hanging out. Would you like to, uh, would you like a cup of tea or something? Would you like a coffee or something? I don't know. Why are you stuck up here? What do you want? You want to go up to the tippy top? Oh, you want to go up? Okay, okay, okay. Let me help him out. Let me help him out. The, the villagers are a little bit slow. Let me go ahead and get rid of that. Okay, go ahead. Go ahead. What are you going to do now? And he literally left. Oh, villagers. I'll just replace that. Where'd he go? He left. Excuse me. Wow, this is my house. You slammed the door in my face. This is my house, sir. This is my house. What are you even doing over here? No, the barbecue isn't today. That was for next week. You're going to cook us a fish or something? All right, I'll let you stay here. But only if you cook us a fish. Yes? All right. But he ain't sleeping in my bed, though. Get your own bed. Now I got to make another bed for him. Oh, this is great. Bubbles, what? what how, did you invite him? Bubbles invited him. Nothing. Bubbles is anti-social. This is like uh, talking to villagers. Come on, Bubbles. Let's get out of here. We got a bridge now. You don't have to worry about going over uh, the water. Okay, come on. I don't know what I'm going to do with that guy, but he, whatever. He, I guess he lives there now. Skittles, sheep. Oh, come with me. Let me show you something. I've been doing some cool stuff. I've been adding some more details over here in our awesome brand new storage building and it is so cool you probably from this angle you can't tell there's something new in there right you can't tell you're like sauce there's nothing new that's exactly what you had last episode let me show you something look at that oh isn't that cool i got a lot of suggestions from you guys to implement the second floor somehow maybe put a tower maybe add something really simple like a a, a weeping vine or something it's a weeping vine the, the twisty vine you can just go upstairs from the inside and some people were saying sauce is building organic build something cool one of my friends meso who actually Gave an awesome suggestion about putting the bushes underneath the bridge last episode. I was like, so, so why don't you build a little bit of a broken tree stump on the side of this thing and get yourself up there? And this is what I did. Look at this. Pretty much it's just uh, another version of the one we did over there in our potion brewer. But a little taller, a little skinnier, uh, a little a little chunkier though on the bottom, all right? It's looking pretty thick. It's looking awesome. And check that out. Oh, it's so cool. We had a little bit of soul sand and two kinds of wood in here. We have spruce. We have some stripped dark oak. We have some dirt piled up to the side. The souls are talking. What do you want to say? You like it? You like it, Souls? Oh, yes, I do too. But was that you or the Souls? You just girl. You say that. Let me show you, though. Let's go on the inside. So super simple. Once you come on in here, we got a little gold armor here on the side, a little backup armor. We got some cool little sections there of storage. And then it gets up to this section here. And it's a bunch of random junk. So paintings and stuff just to add a little bit more detail. The broken rooftop bit here with the campfires and the trap doors soul fire lanterns with chains hanging down oh this is so awesome it matches definitely the whole aesthetic of this whole entire island but you know what let's go on in let me show you extra storage because you know why i'm gonna need it you never know but this is also coming from my friend sis slayer who told me sausage just put more chests up here you're gonna need more chests so there you go we got a bunch of chests lined up here uh it's not as much as downstairs but this is almost like the excess stuff the extra bits and then also here on the bottom we have uh more crafting benches hidden we got some extra furnace here on the sides all nice and tucked in and then over here pretty much just little archways with tiny flower additions what do you think rate this one out of ten sauces is one being sauces blow up the second floor and 10 sauces be sauces Ooh! and that's the sound of you passing out hitting the floor but you know what you hit it uh, uh, really softly because there's a bunch of pillows underneath that's fine you know what i haven't seen this place at night with shaders in a long time why don't we do a little bit of a shader tour in the darkness Bob, don't, don't, don't be scared girl it's a mushroom island anyway there's no bad guys down here
he's just awesome at night. Oh, I love it. Oh, man. Now I gotta go to sleep. I knew it. I had a feeling you were gonna take my bed. Can you please get out of here? This is my bed. I thought you were sleeping. What are you doing looking at me? It's a little weird that villagers go to sleep with their eyes open. I don't know about you, but that should be something that could be changed, Mojang. Come on. Get my bed back. Thank you. Don't you dare stand. Don't you dare stand on top of me. You serious right now? Oh, and check this out right here. I mentioned it in the last episode. I wanted to build little villager houses over here, but not only are they just any villager houses, these are houses for all my tier three YouTube supporters. So if you guys want a house for yourself, last season we had so many just scattered all over my season three part of the world. So we're bringing it back finally. We're gonna start doing this. I'm gonna add these uh, as much as I can. So for today, this one is a long awaited, long overdue house for one of my amazing supporters. This is home of Afri. Did I say that right? I know I said it wrong, but it's fine. Home of Afri. Thank you so much for all the support. All the tier threes get houses. There you go. And not only any house, uh, villagers live here. Uh, this one villager just totally left um, there, and it was like, you know what? Finally, I get to get out of that house. And, um, there they are hanging out, but they uh, sleep over here. <laughs> Look how cool on the inside. So this is my idea of little mushroom houses that I planned. I'm going to put a couple more here. We can still fit a couple in this island, but the majority, I'm going to be putting it over there on that side. We're going to even have like a sectioned off area for all the uh, the amazing supporters. Like, like hi. <laughs> but there you go. Uh, hopefully you guys enjoy these little houses. I'm going to be adding a lot of different kinds, different versions, different colors. But what do you think? Let me know what you think of this little tiny mushroom house. And would you like a little tutorial on this? This is literally going to be like an eight minute tutorial. Maybe even even less maybe like a five minute it's so simple uh but it's so so cool the details it just it's, it's ultra packed with details but it's super simple to make it it's very very tiny very starter worthy in size but not in material because you definitely got to get all that <laughs> you got to get uh these mushroom stands and stuff like that but it's a really cool design what do you think also, we have a name for our beautiful kitty cat, Bubbles' his greatest friend in the history of friends right here hanging out. And you know what? It's just, it wasn't just one person who said this name. It was like 45 people said to call this kitty cat this name. So I had to do it. And boop, honey. <laughs> What's up, honey? You sweet girl. But check this out. Also, we have a new um, bee right there. It's a brand new bee. It's hovering right inside. It's trying to get into the... Um, the, the beehive, but the problem is they're a little bit too chunky, but it's okay. Liam Beeson will help. Is this Liam? No, it's a soon to be named bee. I've been making more babies, so I got a bunch more. I got to name the ones from last time. I still haven't done that, but I'll do it uh, before the next episode. But look at this. We got a brand new bee. It's totally not a sheep hanging. It's just a bee. Big chunky bee. And then also this guy. I have no idea. Don't ask me. No clue how that happened. Also, in today's episode, we're going to be doing an adventure. That's right. We're going to be going off into the water and jumping in there and going into a guardian temple. Not only any guardian temple, it's going to be just a, no, it's just a regular guardian temple. But guess what? It's going to be a guardian temple that I'm going to go into with uh, Bubbles. Me and Bubbles are going to go down there. I got a swimsuit for her. I got snorkeling equipment. It's going to be fanta fantastic. I thought she was going to bite me. She ain't going. That's crazy. But she is going to help me make some potions. Right, Bubbles? All right. And you know what? Our greatest potion brewer right here, Shadow the Cat. Shadow, come on up. Yeah, we need to make some potions because I asked you guys last episode, what kind of potions do I need? Shadow told me I need to, uh, to, to get a potion of leaping. I don't know what that means or how is that going to be any help to us whatsoever in a guardian farm. But you know what? I trust her. Sit right there, girl. Thank you so much. Bubbles, you want to supervise? Come on in. Bubbles don't know what she's doing. It's fine. She doesn't want to go. She just wants to sleep. Just wants to sleep. It's fine. Bubbles. All right, she just, she just doesn't want to. Okay, you stand right there. You sniff the log like normal. All right, beside potion of leaping, which I can't get, Shadow, because guess what? I don't have any bunny rabbits around here. I'm going to be doing some water breathing, and also I'm going to be making a little thing called night vision. So we're going to be needing for night vision and uh, water breathing puffer fish, right? And we're also going to be needing some nether ward right there. We're going to be needing some of these bad boys. And wait, what is night vision? I think it's golden carrots. I told you to stock that up, girl. What happened? She don't even know what's going on. Okay, I need carrots and, 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 and made out of gold. Hold on, I'll be right back, guys.
All right, I think I have everything we need right here. We got the nether wart, we got puffer fish, we got some redstone dust to make the potions last longer. We got golden carrots, we got shadow meowing, bubbles barking, sniffing tree stumps and everything. Uh, I think we're good with that. And yeah, let's get to work. All right, I think we're good to go, but guess what? I think I might have overdone it. Uh, look at all this. <laughs> we got all these night visions here. We got all these water breathings. I, I was gonna do some invisibility, but I'd rather have my armor on there, so that'll be fine. I gotta find my netherite helmet, though, and replace this thing. It's not gonna be any help uh, right now in uh, the underwater worlds, but uh, I think we're good to go. Um, let me go find my helmet. I can't find my helmet anywhere. Did I ever make a helmet? Can you guys remember? Let me know in the comments. Did I ever make a netherite helmet or even a diamond one and just uh, at all i don't i have no idea i i don't think i ever made a netherite helmet do you know huh i know i have not organized this thing yet um uh, it's a work in progress all right i found my diamonds uh, i'll just make another one uh, and you know what since i'm already here might as well see if i can upgrade this sword because i don't think we're gonna do much damage with this looting three knockback too we need a little bit of sharpness or something do we have sharpness here Ooh, that's a one. Uh, better than nothing. Ooh, sharpness three. Even better. Ooh, I'll take a sweeping edge. Ooh, double sharpness three. Maybe I can bind those bad boys together. All right, let's see if this works. So, sword, reaper of souls. Give me your sharpnesses, please. That is not bad. Wait, what if I do... How much are you? That's just four. Okay, and then if I put that here... Yes, yes, yes. Wait, what if I connect these two together i might just i might miss out on it let me just do this and if i could add you after oh, it's too expensive that's fine you know what this is good this is better than it was before can i put sweeping edge on a helmet that would be pretty cool just headbutt people and have them go flying no i uh, just in case you never know and you know what just so we could get something on this helmet there it is protection three and you know what since we're here already Name this helmet in the comment section, but hashtag helmet, give you something cool. I'm gonna put netherite eventually. It's gonna be the most OP helmet you've ever seen, but for right now, it's gonna have to do. All right, I'm gonna put some of these away. I'm not gonna need all of these. Let's just take uh, eight minutes each. Eight, 60, 24, 32. I'm not gonna spend that long in here. That, that's good enough. And for good luck, I'm bringing my girl, Ariel. Bubbles, uh, be good, okay? Hang out here with uh, Shadow, and I will be right back. It's gonna be fine. It's gonna be safe. I am definitely not gonna die. Maybe? You wanna come with me? You want to come with me? You probably sink the boat, though, anyways. Ah, forget it. Oh, one last thing. I need some milk. Thank you. Oh, even the soul's like that. Let me taste it first, though. Is it good? Oh, delicious. Give me some more of your milk. Oh, very nice. All right. I'm ready. Are you guys ready? Let's do this. Oh, baby. This is going to be a lot of fun. Let's go. Don't hit me. Thank you. Oh, let's go. Uh, let's start down below and let's work our way around. Hello. Oh, hi. That kind of hurt a little bit. I have netherite armor. It's not going to hurt that much. Oh, hi. Oh, I haven't had a good old lantern in a very long time. Let's eat some meat. Underwater meat. Please don't hurt. Can this block you? It doesn't block. Why did I bring it if it doesn't block? I thought this blocks it. Let's go. Oh, is there gold in here? I'm going to need that for our piglin friends. Can you guys spare a gold or two? Oh, that's fine. Don't, don't hit. Don't hit. Be gentle. Let's go. You know what? I'm just going to go look for your uh, your big bad guy, and I'll take care of these other little guys later. Stop it. Don't touch me. Oh, hello. Hi. It's me, Sausage. I am your friend. I'm also going to kill you. Get out. Oh, God. Oh, no. Oh, no. I should have brought some building blocks to uh, block the way. It's fine. I got meat to protect me. Let's go. One more time. Can I hit you really quick? Oh, no. Oh, hi. Can I hit you? Get. Oh. You made a little a little squeal sound. You're like a little piggy. You're like a cute little underwater piggy. Come here. Go, 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 go. Get your thorns out. Oh, no, please. Don't hurt me. 
Are you aiming at me? Don't aim down sight, okay? Don't ADS me. Uh, it should be one more hit, right? Maybe one more. Oh, no. Oh, no. Swim faster. Swim faster. Oh, I'm dead. I'm dead. Good night, everybody. It's been nice knowing you. It's fine. We got this. Let's go. Get him. Get out of here. Give me your sponge. Oh, that's gross. He drops a sponge. I wonder where he had it tucked in. Next. See you guys later. Don't worry. I'm not going to attack you. I'm just going after your big sister. Stop. You know what? I'm going to unleash my secret weapon in a little bit. If you guys become a little bit too tough for me, I'm going to release my secret weapon. Ariel is ready. And I will unleash this lady onto your face. She will bite you off. She's like a hybrid salmon slash piranha. My name's Sausage, and you're dead. And you're dead. Can I please take you out? I just got to practice before the next round. Got him. Finish him. All right. Next floor. Oh, hi. You're here. Welcome. Oh, that was a good hit. You saw that? Did you see that coming? I didn't, th I didn't think you saw that coming. Get out of here. Get this time, you don't have your little friends around to defend you. So I can just go in here and boop, 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 like that. Get out. Oh, God. Oh, oof. Oh, oh. <laughs> okay. That one hurt. Okay. I, I, you can have that one. You can have that one. That one hurt. This shield is not doing nothing for me, by the way. Attack. Attack. Oh, God. You got me right in the face with that... Uh, whatever that was. Get him! Get! Oh! Oh, oof, oof. Okay, I'm retreating, retreating, retreating. I'm smart. I'm a smart boy. Keep your thorn, stupid! Got him. Oh, what are you doing there? Were you hiding while your friend was dying? You probably kill me now, though. No, you're not. All right, we got one left. One more to go. Do you know where your um friend is? Huh? Oh, get out of here. Get slapped. I don't see a sponge room, though, which I'm very, very sad about. Place is like a labyrinth. I have no idea where I am or where I'm going. I'll be with you in a moment, Gold. Excuse me, can you please get out of the way? I'm trying to look for your boss. Hi. Hello, excuse me, do you know where your boss is? No? Okay. Is that it, though? Hi! Oh, you scared me a little bit. A little jump scare right there. That's fine. I can take it. I watch horror movies. It's cool. What's your guy's favorite horror movie? Let me know in the comment section. I love Aliens and Alien. That counts. It's like sci-fi horror, right? That totally counts. It was pretty cool. What else? There's so many good ones out there. Oh, man. It's the first ones I could think of, though, right off the bat. They oh, no. I found him. I found him. Look at this. Sneak attack. Sneak attack. Oh, you found me. No sneaking attacks in here. Get out. Get out. Get. 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 Oh. You know, you didn't even hurt me that much. You want to come down here? You can't. You can't think. Cause you think. Oh. Stop. Stop. Got. Got. Oh. Ooh, I missed. Oh. Get down. Water meat. All right. Here it is. Let's go. Finish him. Got him. We did it. We win. We win this game. This is it. Oh, man. I don't see a sponge room, though. I am so sad, though. But that's fine. Hello. Do you know that your boss is defeated? Now you can go away. You don't need to be here anymore. You don't have a leader. Can I be your leader? I should be the guardian leader. That's it. Call me that guardian leader. Sounds like, you know, I'm in a Navy SEAL movie or something. SEAL Team 6 Guardian Leader Sausage Edition. I don't even know what I'm talking about anymore. But it's fine. I win. All right. You know what? No sponge anywhere to be found. But I am taking this dark prismarine. But I can't because I still have... Oh, 30 seconds. Okay. In 30 seconds, all this dark prismarine will be mine. Excuse me? I'm just waiting for this dark prismarine. There we go. Come to your favorite boy. Mythical J sauce is a J is silent. I'm going to take all this dark prismarine and we're definitely going to be building stuff with it. Man, but I can't wait till we do our little farm. Is then we're definitely going to get all the dark prismarine. Excuse me. Can I please get this in peace? Get out of here, please. Get, get, get. Leave me alone. Let me get this dark prismarine in peace. Oh, more dark prismarine. Now, let's get the gold. Oh, I love gold. This is so good. We can trade with the piglins. Oh, this is the greatest find. This is almost as good as sponge. Almost as good. I really needed that sponge. And I'll take the rest of this dark prismarine, too. Oh, baby. What a great day this is. Man, we didn't die. We killed a bunch of these stupid big old uh, chubby guardians. Stop it. I am trying to get the dark prismarine in peace. Oh, I'm about to die. Water meat. I didn't even have to use Ariel this time. Oh, what a great day. You guys didn't want me to unleash Ariel. All of you are going to die like in two seconds. So you don't even want that. You don't even want that. Get, get, get out of here. Oh, look at this place. Oh, baby. So close to the to the farm, right? Look at that. Guardian farm. You're going to get it. I'm going to make the coolest guardian farm in the history of guardian farm. You just wait. You just watch. It's going to be so nice. This place looks good even without shaders, though. Look how nice that looks. I like the light glow of the soul fire. Look how pretty. But you know what? Let's go ahead and uh, let's just check and see the loot that we got today. Bobo Shadow, what's up, guys? Check this out. We were able to get a stack of regular Prismarine and 12. We got one, two stacks of Dark Prismarine and eight. 12 sea lanterns, eight blocks of gold, some wet sponges, some shards and crystals. Check all that out. What do you think? No big deal for you, okay? You rather have me brought you a little chew toy or maybe some catnip or something? That's fine. 
But you know what? This was such a fun adventuring episode. Let me know if you guys want to see more of these. Just fun. No, not too much building. Maybe just some showcase stuff, but mostly just out in the world doing some crazy fun adventuring stuff with life on the line. Kind of, uh, kind of odds, you know? When the chips are down, your boy Sausage just uh, pulls every single bit of courage inside him and defeats the bad guys. Would you like more of these? Let me know if you like more of these videos like this. But you know what? Next episode, I'm very, very excited. We finally got the Dark Prismarine, so what I'm thinking about doing is doing a lighthouse right behind me right there doing a little bit of terraforming lifting that up a little bit off the ground maybe making like a little bit of a rock bridge kind of thing not even a bridge like a little rock path from that section where the farm is over to this side and then stack up make a very cool and awesome lighthouse and i'm thinking the pallet Maybe a little bit of quartz maybe a little bit of diorite maybe a little bit of bone bob but a foundation in blackstone with the dark prismarine and the warp block on the tippet top of the lighthouse. Oh, I got I got some ideas. Let me know if that's a good palette or if some other palette might be cooler. But for right now, I am out of here. Thank you all so much for watching. Thank you for hanging out with me today. Hopefully you had some fun. I know I did. And then very, very soon, also, Guardian Farm in the back. We need one. We're going to have a lot of dark prismarine in our world. Trust me. So I'm going to need a very, very good farm. But for right now, I am out. Thank you all so much for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed. I'll catch you guys on the next Minecraft video. Goodbye.